I wanted to let everybody know that last episode, y'all made me feel real good because I noticed that there was still blood on the face. I didn't think, I didn't know it was going to be that big of a deal because everybody was like, yo, I, you, you're the only one that realized there was blood on the face. That's because I'm goaded, all right? Sean, is there anything you want to say to the people before we get started? Is there anything you want them to know? Apparently not. <laughs> good. I'm glad I gave you the option to give them information and you declined. <laughs> I am ready to see what's happening next. <laughs> He thinks he's blacking out. Is she killing him? Mm. Woo -hoo. A la 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 la. Yo, she this animation. Oh. This is seeming like a Gohan situation. She was saying last episode, like, you're weaker or something mm -hmm. than back when they fought. So, like, you're strong as a kid, maybe? I don't know. That's crazy to think about because he's OP in my opinion, but I guess, I guess not. Oh, mm. this fucking show. <laughs> they, they get creative with the title cards. That's great. Oh man. Strong enough to satisfy you. What the fuck, bro? Is the size of your dissatisfaction? Oh, <laughs> really? <laughs> bro. Look at his face. Oh! oh! What? Mm. I, fake, I wake up feeling reborn. Is she fucking killing him? Mm. That's how it seemed to me. But she's basically saying he enjoyed the fight so much that he only likes fights that are really close. Mm. So he purposely makes himself weak so the fights are really close. What? That's crazy. What? She's she's killing him and bringing him back. Oh. Oh shit. That's crazy looking, bro. Ooh. <laughs> Playtime has ended. Oh, she's busted. So she's saying he was stronger than her as a kid? Oh, Jesus. What is it? Yeah. Ooh. To the point where he he handicaps himself to fight people. So if he'd have fought ich Ichigo without these chains, he'd have killed them probably, disintegrated them or some shit. I mean, that was kind of obvious. Even back then. <laughs> Mm. Oh no, it's gonna happen right now. Damn. Oh. 
子供みたい<笑>何を話しむことがあるのです存分に戦える敵も対等に渡り合える仲間もそして何より、うん、あなたと共に目覚めた相棒がいるのかあほう私がこれまで手役目を果たして死ねることのなんと幸福であることか Damn, we didn't need you to die, bro. Damn, she's dead. That was sad. Her bunkai was so cool. Yeah. Hajimi Maste. <laughs> what? What? Don't fucking play with my eyeballs right now and tell me the name. I want to know the name, Sean. Next time on Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> oh, okay. The name of the sword is Hoden. <laughs> Bro, oh, man. <laughs> Quato! <laughs> Squiotto! Love it! <laughs> it is sad! <laughs> This is the Hoden. Mm -hmm. It is the Hoden, bro. Are、oh, they gonna make Kon into a Zabak t o I would be kind of upset. Blade Glot? Blade God? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, Oden. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> What those legs do? Word. <laughs> nice pose. <laughs> House Pundy Hill. <laughs> you feel me, right? Oh! Y'all can fly. Oh, fuck. Jeez. ラブを受けない残白刀はこんなにも絶やすく壊れてしまうんだね。ここから生きて出てこれたら残白刀を打ち直してあげてもいいよ。バドチュ <laughs> 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 I like him. <laughs> yeah, I like him too. <laughs> As oh! So we skipped that part. <laughs> Renji's like, fuck it. Ew, bro. They have mouth eyes and they're drooling from their eyes,、yeah. which are mouths. That's not drool. <laughs> oh, yeah. They're not gonna tell us. Are you fucking kidding me?、Oh, there's four minutes left. There's gotta be after credits. The funny thing is, is I never get mad at it. I'm just like, damn, I wish it wasn't over. Damn, I appreciate the time skip.、Mm -hmm. What? He got the shit beaten out of him. <laughs> What is happening? Ichigo's the savior, bro. You better stop playing with me. Ichigo stayed going through it, bro. Can we just. Well, let me not say that. I was going to say, can I have something easy? But they typically give him easy shit, too. 
That's crazy. He just got dismissed. Damn, he really sent his ass back home. That's crazy. So let's go in chronological order. Uh, <laughs> okay. Because there was a lot of shit that happened. This was heavily exposition weighted mm -hmm. episode yeah i really enjoyed the explanation that uh unohana gave in terms of why zaraki was weak and why killing him was helping make him stronger it wasn't like gaining experience he wasn't training she was trying to remove the shackles that he was placing on himself by putting him in these near-death situations in order to make him properly fight which mm -hmm. uh, i quite liked and yeah. we got to see a really cool bankai uh yeah it was cool that she powered him up to a point where he can hear his zangpakuto which is yeah. crazy because he's been he's had that sword since ever and he's never heard it and then i remember going back to like when he lost the ichigo and he tried to hear it and he still couldn't yeah. hear it you know what i'm saying and then now like he can hear it you know that shit is i just i don't know how strong he's gonna be because mm. did she remove all the shackles is he still like not at his maximum like you know what i'm saying like does he still have more to go you know what i'm saying like could he keep climbing higher how much stronger is he than everybody else she did say he could fight with them on an equal level but i i hope he's like ridiculous i hope he's like stupid strong because now he knows his sword's name he could probably get a bankai now right mm -hmm. which what <laughs> <laughs> can you imagine Kenpachi with a bank? Well, you probably can because you read this. I can't imagine him with a bankai, bro. So I need to see, I need to see what that's gonna look like. So, well, I mean, that's been the age-old question, right? As soon as Zaraki was introduced and he fought Ichigo, everyone was always saying, "What would happen if he actually knew his sword's name? Wouldn't he just be like the strongest mm -hmm. because he's so strong and he doesn't even know like his shikai?" Mm -hmm. yeah who knows the sky's the limit um from here and then uh moving on to itsu i don't know sword creator guy yeah uh very cool personality very eccentric there was a lot of hints there i'm surprised you didn't pick up but it's, it's not really spoilers because what did uh we learn about ichigo officially i think it was episode seven about his heritage oh that he's a a quincy yeah, and what was the sword guy saying to him at the end of the, this episode just now? That he's a fake soul reaper? I mean, I, I won't go into anything, but Listen, leave that to have, have some thoughts about that. Sean, you are a big brain of this operation. <laughs> I am not big brain. I fail tests on a daily basis. Don't fucking quiz me, bro. <laughs> I'm gonna lose. <laughs> like, I mean, <laughs> as, far as, as far as watching the show, you record all, all the information you needed to. So as long as you're aware of that, that's cool. Um, but he was hinting at that uh, there's a reason why Ichigo can't uh, use one of those nameless swords to create his own Zanpakuto or something along those lines. So um, it's to do with whether he's Quincy or human or hollow or whatever. So it's one of those reasons. And he was calling him a fake Shinigami. So, yeah. Ichigo's fucking everything, bro. Mm. <laughs> he's everything. Like, if they come out with a new, like, species or something, he's that, too. <laughs> he's yeah. everything, bro. He's, because, how many classes of, of people are there? There's Shinigami, there's Hollow, there's Quincy, and then there's Human. Am I missing anything else? Well, I guess Aranka and Visor, but there's, like, subcategories, right? Okay, cool. Well, okay, cool. Aranka and Visor. He's five of the six. Hmm. <laughs> He's just not an Iran car. He's everything else. Yeah. Ichigo is super protagonist powers. So <laughs> yeah. they're like, oh, we have a new demon race. 
Ichigo is part demon in his left toe. And because yeah. <laughs> his dad went to hell and fucking, well, you know, like, he's, uh, whatever. I like it, though. I don't care. Make him as OP as you fucking want to. It's just crazy yeah. that I feel like every time we go through a training arc, Ichigo's got it the worst, bro. He always gets it the worst, no matter what. The training for the, to be a visor or the hollow training, right? To train his mask. He was getting fucked up in that little box for Mad Long. Then for yeah. him to be uh, uh, a Shinigami, he was in that pit and had the chain on him, and he was getting fucked up down there. Like, when are we going to just... I can't say that. I can't say that because it's Ichigo. Like, I can't say, when is he going to get it easy? It is, it, he gets it easy, and he has it hard at the same time. Pause. So, like, I, fuck it. I just really like Ichigo, bro. You give him whatever he yeah. wants, bro. I don't care. He can have it all. Give it to him. And then just finally, I'm almost certain they added some things to this episode that weren't in the manga, which they've been doing uh, throughout this airing of these 13, I think, episodes. So it's always cool to see some extra content, and I think they fleshed out that Zaraki flashback with Unahana just a little bit more than it was. But yeah, interesting stuff. Ichigo got sent back to the world of the living, to Mm -hmm. his daddy. Mm -hmm. So (laughs) I guess we'll see what happens next, yeah. Yeah, bro. I really like the pacing of this show, so I don't I, like. I really have no complaints. I'm enjoying this shit so far. It's probably the best thing I've watched all year. So I'm like, I'm super, I'm super, like, I guess satisfied is the word I'm looking for. Every episode I've seen, I've been like content. Like, ah, this is great. You know, I can't wait yeah. for the next one. Ah, this is great. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like every episode, I'm just like, ah, it's great. <laughs> so. Yeah. Anyway, we're not going to hold y'all up. Y'all know what to do. All the links in the description, Patreon, Uncut, all of that. Social media, join my Instagram, Discord, and all that. We'll see you in the next one.